So I have spent the morning getting the thank you cards for the bridal shower all ready to go. And I know what you're thinking. You're like, okay, wait, it's Tuesday. And next Saturday you're getting married and you're just sending out thank you cards. I know. But my sister-in-law put them together for me. And then she didn't give me them until the beginning of September. And then I kind of forgot about them. But I'm getting them done today so I can get the stamps on them and get them sent out. But today I am putting together the wedding gifts I got for my sister, Ken's sister, my mom, his mom. And then I just ordered one for my dad that will be here Friday. But you guys will actually not see this vlog until after the wedding due to the fact that again, my sister and my mom watch my vlogs and I don't want them to see this one and then know what I got them. So I am going to sit down. I want to show you guys the stuff that I bought for them and then I'm just gonna put everything together. Also, I can show you guys because they are so adorable is these are the thank you cards. <laughs> And then the back was blank for me to write whatever, but aren't they so cute? So cute. <laughs> uh, but I want to show you guys what I got them. I want to put it together and then just kind of chat with you guys. I feel like the last few vlogs have been just chat with me vlogs. And I think that's just because with the wedding coming up and just with everything going on right now in my head... I just feel very chatty. So I am actually going to find my tripod real fast so I can set that up and we'll get to wrapping and showing you guys what I bought for everybody. So first, I couldn't find bags that were close to the colors I wanted, which we were, of course, were just at Walmart, so I probably could have went to like Target or the paper source store Madison and found something but I just kind of wanted to put them together and this was before I ordered what I ordered for my dad so I just went with blue and I went with these cute ones and then these cute ones and I got bigger ones because what I got my sister and my sister-in-law are two things and what I got my mom and my soon to be mother-in-law smaller things and once my dad's comes I'll have to get another bag but for now it's good so I told myself I really wanted to get something little for everybody just to say you know thank you and like I appreciate you and I knew from the beginning that I wanted to get my self my sister and my sister-in-law robes and I was so excited when they came so I unwrapped mine which I will show you right now because they are adorable so when I was looking for robes I was trying to find ones that were kind of close to the color scheme for the wedding but I couldn't find anything and I'm pretty sure if I would have looked I could have found something but I was trying to find something that I could get with the words on the back of it that like bride, uh, matron of honor, bridesmaid and I couldn't find ones that were in the price range I was looking for to get and then I actually found ones that were the color but they didn't have words in the back and I was like you know what forget it I'll just order uh uh like a champagne kind of color and is that not so cute I think if I get closer and it has the flowers and everything and it is so cute I'll even put it on for you <laughs> move the box but it is so cute and it's going to be perfect for the morning of the wedding, but it's lengthwise and it comes with a belt, but it is just adorable. So I got myself this one and then I got my sister 
and my sister-in-law one which I didn't open theirs like I said I opened mine and then it came with this to wrap around to secure it so this bag is mine and I'm not sure if I want to keep them in the bags they came in I think I do because I want them to see it the way it is so the way they come is obviously so you can read what they say with the flowers I think the sunlight coming in <laughs> everything is not helping but then that one says bridesmaid and I love the flower look of them because they were so cute so I got those two for them and then I also decided I wanted to get like a little bit of jewelry or something so I got them these bracelets and it says I couldn't let's see if this is better <laughs> I couldn't tie the knot without you and what I thought was cute with these is the bracelets so it comes with this little thing that says it and then the bracelets have like the knot that is a heart and then it comes with a little thing that I put their initials in A for Elise and T for my sister so I actually want to turn that one around and they actually came with these cute little bags and these cute things to I think clean them so I got my sister one and then I also got my sister-in-law one just because they are both my bridesmaids so I thought I'd just put them in their little things and I will show you my sisters real quick because Again, it is the same as Elise's, but it has a T on hers. So I'm just putting these little things inside for now, just in case they want them to clean them. Like everything came with like little like cleaning things, which I thought was really, really cute. So these are going together. What is, oh, I think they just kept that bag. And then for my mom, I wanted to get her a necklace and I thought it would be really cute just to get her something to say you know thank you and everything so I found this all of this is off of Amazon and I will link everything so you guys can go see but then I got my mom this And it says, Dear Mom, you held my hand for many years, supported me through joys and tears, and though I'm growing up and on my own, my heart will always be tied to home. Thank you for your un unending support and guidance, patient and infinite, infinite love. As I start a new chapter in my life, I want you to know that I am proud and blessed to be your daughter. I love you. And I just thought that was just so freaking sweet. So I got her this and I think that I'm just going to leave it in the box how it is because it is so cute and I think what I might do is just leave it in this box and not put it back in like this box because that's what it came in but I thought that would be cute and then I also got my soon-to-be mother-in-law a necklace as well which was funny because hers actually came with like a little bag which you could put it in um, but I think I'm just going to use the box that I actually got just because or the bag I actually got because I wanted them all to be the same but it came in this cute little box. It actually came with this like card and stuff. And then it came with a pad to clean. But then hers looks like this. And her says to the best mother-in-law, I want to let you know that I'm grateful for you and your son. I was falling in love with the boy you raised into an incredible man. Your kindness, your warmth, and your love have shaped him in shaped him to be the most wonderful man I ever met. 
I am beyond lucky, lucky to have an extra gift of you in my life as well. Thank you for always welcoming me into your family with open arms and a warm heart. Your relationship has meant so much to me and I feel so lucky to have you in my life. And I know this is just going to make her cry because I almost cried. So I think I'm just going to put this cleaning pad down without that being in there and put that back in the box and then have a little box. So I am actually going to open this little card because I don't know if it says anything on the inside. It says, oh no, it's just blank. It says, all the best, best wishes for you. So, I mean, that was a cute little addition, but I don't think I'm going to use it. And then it just has like a little thank you card of like saying thank you for your purchase and everything. So I think I'll just keep all this stuff together and put it back in here. And now I'm just going to put everything in the bags. These are really big, but I couldn't find anything smaller than that. It was crazy. So now the thing I have to think about is how I want to put these in here. Maybe I'll fold them so then they kind of go down and then this can go right here. Again, I probably could have got a smaller bag than this because there's a lot of room in there, but you're not even seeing my face. <laughs> so all of these bags are good and then I just got the same the blue because I just wanted it to match the bags and then we'll just put a few in here so it has just it's been such a journey and I know that I have brought you guys pretty much along the whole journey for this wedding and it's just crazy to think that it's going to be here in the matter of no time and I just keep thinking to myself like geez like it has really gone by super fast and I cannot believe we're almost here oh I think one will go perfect for these but I think anybody who's gone through like the wedding process knows that it is just like it's so much fun and it's just craziness and then you know you're just anxious for everything to be here and the day to be here and I'm just so excited for everything and I'm just so excited to see how the room turns out when we decorate it and everything and I'm excited to give everybody their gifts and everything too it's just I am just excited to be able to do this and have this experience and just be able to enjoy the time. So let's see. I think we'll just put two at the top for this guy. The only other thing I think I'm going to do is I'm going to buy like little tags. Um, we're actually, uh, going to go to Walmart today and I'm going to actually get little tags to put on the kids' favors just so then I know who each one is for and then I am going to buy tags to put on these so I know who's, who's is who's for the gifts so I don't end up giving the wrong person the wrong one. But now they are all done. So we now have all the gifts ready to go. The only issue with these bigger ones is that because there's so much room, maybe I'll put one at the bottom. But 
here they are already set to go see with these I think what I'll do is I'll put like one at the bottom to hold it up because these are like sinking and then it'll be able to go perfectly and stay where it is and these ones are perfect I'm back so apparently I ran out of space on my memory card I went and put everything upstairs because the cats were getting into it and then he was being a nuisance upstairs but I am back and I wanted to order my dad something and he is really into handkerchiefs so I actually found one that you could like was a pair together for mom and dad so I ordered those and those will be coming on Friday and then I also ordered a dress to wear at the rehearsal but the handkerchiefs are really cute so that's the one for mom and then that's the one for dad and the mom one says to dry your happy tears on my wedding day as you have always dried mine you love and support your love and support has made me the woman I am today I am blessed to call you my mother and best friend today a bride tomorrow a wife forever your daughter I love you and then for the dad one it says a dad holds his daughter's hand for a short while but he holds her heart forever as you give me away know that I will always be your little girl Thank you for being the best dad anyone could ask for. I am so blessed to have you in my life. I love you. And I just thought that was perfect. So those are on the way. And also I got this dress that is on the way, which I am super excited about. Uh, but I am just excited to put everything together. I'm excited to give them to them and see the reactions. And again, you won't see this vlog until after the wedding just because people that are coming to the wedding watch my vlogs and I don't want to spoil anything. But thank you for spending today with me and letting me just chat with you about the things that I got and how excited I am and just things to come. I am just so excited about just every day that passes and the closer that it gets and I just can't wait for it to be here and to celebrate Mary and Ken. And like I said before, I'm going to try to record a little bit of the morning of the wedding and then a little bit maybe during the day. We'll see what I can get. But thanks for spending a little bit of time with me while I put together the wedding gifts. I know you guys are going to be really confused because I'm jumping from one video to the next but I recorded this video and I said to myself okay I'm ending it here I showed you everything and then I was getting the video ready for September 21st and realized that I was showing stuff that I didn't want to be seen until after the wedding. So I kind of spliced stuff together this morning so that's why it seems like obviously I'm jumping from one day to another day and this is why because I wanted to make sure that the gifts that I was getting everybody was in one vlog and all the stuff I didn't want to be seen until after the wedding you know is in one vlog and the stuff that I, I'm okay with being seen before the wedding is in another vlog. So just hang tight with me while I figure this out. I was editing this morning, didn't realize I did it, and then it dawned on me that I was like, no, I don't want this stuff to be seen. Duh. Take it out and put it in another video. So just hang tight with me. I've never had this issue before until right now when I was like, oh my gosh, like, no, this is not what I want to be seen right now, and this is not what I want to be seen in this video. So I hope you guys are enjoying this video I will finish editing it see where I'm at and just enjoy I ended up getting the ones for my mom and dad that I actually showed you guys which I think they are just going to love them uh, okay so they're actually packaged really nice, so I think I'm going to just leave them in there. But they come like this and this. So like I said, I think I might just put... This is actually going to be too big for that little bag. I'll figure it out, but they are so cute. 
And then what I actually did is I didn't tell Ken this, but it's going to be kind of like a surprise unless he watches this vlog then whatever. I actually got us Mrs. with a ring and Mr. for after the wedding, maybe like the next day. And then I actually ended up getting him just a card that I could fill out. And it's just one that says to my groom on our wedding day. And then it's empty on the inside, so I'm going to write him a note. And my thought was I would take the hat and the note and I would attach this to like the hat and then I would give it to somebody to give to him to like on our wedding day. I really, I was thinking about doing something else, like doing like an actual like big gift or something, but I just didn't end up having time and I didn't think about it in time. So the least I thought I could do is just write something to him to, you know, say, hey, it's our day, I love you, and everything. And it actually comes with this cute little envelope with this cute thing to put here. So I am really excited about that. Again, I would have to figure out how to, because like I said, if you remember, this is the size of the bag. <laughs> and that's definitely not going to go in there. So I will have to figure something else out but that's the rest of the stuff i'm excited everything came and i'm excited that i could show you guys so i actually did have an ending <laughs> to that vlog um but of course because i had to slice things together that ending is in the other vlog and i'm just gonna come on and say bye to you guys thank you for hanging in there with me and thank you for letting me share the gifts I got for my family. Again, I will put everything in the description so you can go see it if you liked what I got and you are thinking of, you know, using it for your wedding as well. Anything to help anybody that's planning a wedding. So I will talk to you guys again real soon in the next vlogs. The next vlogs you guys will probably will see will be all the wedding content, so enjoy.